Yo yo what's good YouTube this is Zango and today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a single.php and let me just go into the WordPress codex and show you what a single.php does. It's basically where you do a single post like if you have like uh, a slider for here right now in posts it's basically if we go in here it's supposed to show the single.php let me show you right now I have a static page which also you could get from uh, bootstrap 5 just download the bootstrap 5 examples and go into uh, it's called a blog here yeah so it's called a blog just download that and <coughs> copy the code and also you could learn a lot of, about bootstrap 5 from these example codes I'm gonna explain a little bit what this does. So basically, the, the this is a container, uh, like a CSS normal container, which basically wraps everything around in, in a container. You could do it also a container fluid, which is basically gonna make the the container responsive instead of a container that is gonna be uh, just like a like uh, sm like you saw the size how it like it changed it made it from like non-responsive to something that's more uh, responsive instead of just being stuck in this area and being responsive uh, but so we're just gonna do the container fluid for now let's refresh that yeah all right so first off we want to get the title PHP echo the title so yeah so as you can see if we go into like uh, slider post 3 it's gonna show slider post 3 right now uh, in here we could add something called the excerpt and I'll explain what that is the excerpt is basically like a short summary of the post itself so we could do the excerpt there's nothing gonna be showed up right now because I don't have an excerpt for any of them but let me add one alright let's go into WP admin and just go into your posts edit like slider image one and go into excerpt over here so basically this is gonna be this is an slider image one description so if we just update that uh, go back to post let's get slider number one because this is where I added the uh, so yeah that is the excerpt we could also uh, let's also remove like the rest of this code because we're gonna use this to for the home page I'm not gonna use the whole this for this code I'm just gonna remove a lot of this let's just remove this area so, and I'm explain also what this is so here's another row with a margin bottom of two and a column medium of six which is basically like half the page over here uh, so yeah world and featured post and there's gonna be another column six over here which is gonna basically the gonna be the half of the other page we where we could add also actually like related posts or anything but uh, like I said, we're not gonna use the whole thing. We just I I want the uh, like this area for now. All right, so let me just remove this. Let's refresh that. All right, and we also want to remove all of this p tags. Let's just remove this and add in here. open up a PHP tag and in there 
put in the content which is basically whatever content you're gonna add for the post so here's the image itself uh, what else can we add we could also remove this let's add something else what else could we add we could also add the alright let's actually make it a short video for now we could go into the next the video and we're gonna make a home page in the next video in the video number 12 so alright thank you guys so much for watching this video comment like and subscribe in the next video I'm gonna show you guys how to make the home.php alright peace